Arsene Wenger says this is the most difficult game in the competition. The second leg of the semi-final, the match in which you have everything to lose. Arsenal only survived it thanks to Jens Lehmann's defiant penalty save in Villarreal last time. Manchester United's last defeat in the competition was in the second leg of a semi two years ago. For the fifth year in succession, there will be an English team in the Champions League final. But who and how many, we will soon know. The longest yard of the road to Rome starts here. In the competition, was in the second leg of a semi two years ago. Fabregas invited to shoot, oh, it came off Vidic and off Ferdinand, and a cheap corner for Arsenal. Well, I think Fabregas would be the first to admit that it wasn't his best connection. Defended by Fletcher. Carrick just upended. Van Persie. The flag up. Statistics uh, were more even. Here's Ronaldo getting in behind the Toure. Sanya leaning over Rooney, but finding only Anderson. Ronaldo is on the move here. Giroud matching him stride for stride. Pull back towards Park. Gibbs slips. It's Jason Park. Away. Manchester United, a goal that could be worth twice its weight in goal, a sad and unfortunate slip by Kieran Gibbs, allows G Sun Park to steer Manchester United into a two-goal lead. Park. Fletcher has won it from Fabregas, and Ronaldo has won a free kick from Van Persie. He was offside when the initial ball was played through, it's 35 yards and more. Too far for Ronaldo to think about it. Oh! Absolutely sensational! He went through Almunia, beaten for pace. And Manchester United have scored twice in a little more than ten minutes here. And Cristiano Ronaldo has matched the scorcher he scored. Not dispossessed, he's run through Fletcher, but ever got him second time of asking. And Manchester United's aggregate lead is now 3 0. Wayne Rooney, oh, he did a really good save by Almunia. That was on target. And that was the Almunia we saw at Old Trafford last week. Well, it was clever of Fletcher. Anderson with the corner. Ronaldo, well, the only man marking was Nemanja Vidic. Two of them rose unopposed. Fabregas takes. And so does Van der Sar. Here's Ronaldo again. Scored in the finish and O'Shea forward. It's Rooney is jumping at the far post. Walcott certainly got pace. Evra. And Ronaldo is onside again and for once his control let him down. Nasri though. You know, putting the best slant on it and trying to. Rooney's offside here. And trying to continue to go forward. Crowd very sarcastic cheer for it. Events. But at the moment, two still kind of trying and trying to G the rest, but I think there are one or two heads going as a little aggressive about it. Walcott. Maybe the same could be said of him. Van Persie's cross now. Here's had it by all. Van Persie has spilt it. There's a free kick being given against out by all. Steered in for Van Persie. Kept it on. And goalkeepers get too much protection. Ronaldo, you need protection from him. Dinked in towards Fabregas. Did talk about yesterday the physical strength of Manchester United. Ronaldo. Oh, that was a sliding challenge from Sanya right under the referee's nose. It's Ronaldo. Well, that one did seem to move. But Almunia watched it carefully. Senya. And a by all weights. Couldn't quite time it. Got up between Ferdinand and O'Shea. So far, Arsenal. On the foul on Ronaldo. Song shakes his head. And a lot of the venom went out of the fixture with those two early goals. Ronaldo takes. True measure of control over them. Tonight they've got almost complete control here. Fabregas getting back with the challenge. Walcott held up by Everett. They say, right, you try and break us down. They're not. They don't feel that compulsion. Van Persie, and now Walcott, and now Van Persie. Cross towards Adebayor. Really back there. 
with Walcott. Van Persie takes in towards Adepay. Or I would say goals were handed to Jason Park and to Cristiano Ronaldo, particularly as Ronaldo scored from so far out. Dramatic, dramatic, draining occasions all, but now for Manchester United. There's the passion, the pride, the character now has to kick in. Clearly a suspicious package of some kind that they're investigating. Sniffer Dog just uh, conducting a search, a man in possession. Jason Park is naturally energetic. Watched by a, oh, a former Manchester United player, what's he called? He's playing the right wing, even on the bench in Moscow. Petrofal. Stretching Juru, he has support. Ronaldo will go it alone, and that's a very smart save by Almunia. Very quickly down to his left. Ronaldo equally as dangerous on either side, it seems. Van Persie swung over the head of Juru. Anderson's onside here. And the free kick has eventually gone against him. And he has such versatility in. Foul by Fletcher, it's a complete missed kick. By Sonia, he was just caught. Anderson. Almunia had to deal with that, it's a corner. And Percy takes. I think Van der Sar realised early that there was always a little too much pace on it. Stumbling through the challenges, still going. Stopped by Jura. Ronaldo's offside here. Van Percy, it's a chance for Nasri. Sanya, headed away by Vidic. Ronaldo can break. Jason Park, Rooney's got some space to his left. Here is Wayne Rooney. Ronaldo's getting up with him. Renew, Rooney has found Ronaldo. How about that? How about that? One end of the field to the other in the blink of an eye. Cristiano Ronaldo scores for the second time on the night. And Manchester United can pat their backs for Rome. What a break. Devastating, absolutely devastating for Manchester United. And bring on Ryan Giggs. And it's Anderson who's going to give way. Did well to work shooting space. Forced his fellow countryman into a good save. Bettner though, Van Persie is there, so too is Ferdinand. Vidic has just taken something to the face. To win the ball and find Fletcher. Foul by Nasri. And that is going to be a yellow card. It's it back from Nasri. Bettner stumbles past Bettner. All through the legs of Vosche. That's side netting. Yeah, it's probably a little ambitious. I mean, he's done well to get himself in that position. Ronaldo. Here's Park. It's a good stop by Almunia. He got his angles right. Here's Fabregas trying to provide some on the night. It's a wonderful recovery by Fletcher. Oh, penalty's been given. Oh, he looked to play the ball. Oh, it's a red card. And Darren Fletcher in that moment against Edwin van der Sar. A rather ironic cheer greets the penalty. That is of relatively little consequence because Arsenal still need four more goals. To United. Ibui. Stopped by Raphael. Fabregas. Here comes Van der Sar. It's a bit straight, but Bermatov's control helps him out. Good decision from the keeper. Never going to be able to get two hands on it. Punch was the right thing. Arsenal have a man down and injured. Adebayor. Free kick against him. That's a yellow card from Manuel Adebayor. Oh, this fella seems to have gone for, for everything. Although here's a buoy. Be a free kick then. Minimal contact. Well struck. Wall did its job. And again from Fabregas. Wide. He was stretching in the end, couldn't really get the control on it. Throw men forward again in the hope. Clicked on and Fabregas just helped it straight into the hands of Edwin van der Sar. He couldn't have been expecting it. It's Ronaldo. <laughs> Too bad, was it? Well, he might have been just positioned enough then, Almunia, had it been low enough just to kind of help it on its way, but... Ronaldo caught in the chest, and another Ronaldo free kick on the way, and that's not as good. Ronaldo, here's Giggs! Oh, he just couldn't quite gather it in his stride. It was an elite cup tie in the mid-90s, so might get another opportunity. 
Wes Brown is still struggling to get full fitness. Here's Nasri with a shot. Manchester United will defend the European Cup in Rome. So Alec Ferguson just doesn't want to let go of it. Someone will have to tear it out of his hands. Questions for Arsene Wenger to answer. When does potential become prizes? And all the season without a trophy for Arsenal.